Other, other challenges include uh, learning how to do data analysis. Um, you perform an experiment in such a way that it hopefully gives you data that is worth analyzing. Um, and data analysis begins with, with, with that. Uh, did you even perform the experiment in a good way? Um, but then there's just technicalities of, I have, I have a table of numbers that my apparatus gave me. H how do I analyze that? You know, I have to get it into a piece of software. I have to tell that software, make me a plot, compute an average. Uh, just basic mechanical things. We don't care what programming language they use. Um, whatever they use, we, we promise to help them out uh, with the basics of it. Um, but really, some of the basic tasks they're doing in whatever programming language that is, they're, they're usually not very sophisticated tasks on the scale of computer programming. They're usually very simple things. Uh, but if you don't know how to do it, uh, they're very daunting tasks. Uh, we want students in this class to struggle with the material. To, uh, to, to you know, really work at the things that are useful to learning. We don't want them to struggle with things that are just, my computer won't compile my paper. Um, you know, we, we, don't, we don't want them to struggle with things that are not useful to learning. So again, we have a long series of small tasks that gets people up to speed uh, with some instructor help. Um, Get them up to speed quickly on these multiple small tasks um, so that they are spending their time learning in an efficient way and not just spinning their wheels and, and just getting frustrated and, uh, and learning to hate the subject instead of love the subject like we do.